Oh, good day. In this session we're going to uh, take apart the infamous uh, Honeywell pressure control, the L404A1354. There's the uh, model number there. They no longer make this control and uh, just as well. If you have one of these controls on your boiler, I would recommend getting it changed out for many reasons. Main reason is it's not accurate. I've never seen one of these things accurate out of the box and there's no way even to even think about adjusting it uh, legally. So let's take a look where this one trips off. So here's a pound. There's two pounds. And there's three pounds on the dial here, and about three and a half, and we're almost there. Oh, about a little bit over three and a half pounds. It trips off and resets. <laughs> Is it going to reset? Oh, I'm half a pound. So that's quite a range. You've got that's about the lowest setting you can make on this thing. If you try to grow lower, what will happen, it'll trip off at 3, but then it won't reliably reset. And you'll get a no heat call. It's almost at 0. Uh, that's right, so if you try to go lower than three pounds with this thing, let's see if it resets. And there is a potential no heat callback right there. Three pounds, no reset. Maybe. So just why is this a crappy control? And the answer can be found in the diaphragm. Although it looks like a high dollar item, and it is a high dollar item, The critical part is this guy here. And let's take a look at the PA404A, which comes in just about every steam boiler made in the USA. The diaphragms are exactly the same. <laughs> so they're they cheaped out on this. Let's take a look at uh, same basic controls here, but this one will work at about a pound. A pound is graduated in ounces. That's because the diaphragm is several times larger. And so while this control costs nearly twice as much as this back in the day, this control is more accurate more reliable and it doesn't contain mercury. So let's see where this one trips off. You've seen this one before a couple of my videos. Listen for the clicks. Yeah, about 1.8 resets at about 0.8 and it'll do that all day. You could probably get this a little bit lower. There we are. Let's 
So you can put this thing on here. The vapor stat set at eight ounces. There it is, half a pound. And reset. So you can see the differential is subtractive on this one. You got to make sure that these mercury controls are level. You can see the um, little pendulum in the back there, which is where you're supposed to. If this is just a little bit off, you might have a little trouble. So keep an eye on that with these old mercury controls if you do it. There it is, half a pound. Click. And reset. So. To repeat, if you've got this control on your boiler, get rid of it, replace it with the uh, PA404A, and dispose of the mercury properly. And uh, happy steaming.